Hi everyone. Do you ever just record something like three and four times and for some reason you just cannot get your shit on point? That's me today. So um, I'm going to try and do this rather quickly because I'm so irritated that I just couldn't get it on point for like the longest time. Today I'm going to show you myself building two sets of shelves in replacement of my dresser because after using my dresser for a long while I just felt like it wasn't doing it for me. Things just get lost or crumpled or I forget that I own them because it's all the way at the bottom and my lazy ass doesn't want to bend all the way down just to dig through the bottom drawer. Um, so yeah, I decided to buy two sets of these shelves and build them and just kind of use it as like to display my clothing so I can actually see what I own and um, it also kind of helped me went through some of my old clothes. So obviously you can see my dogs being a part of every single process within this even though they don't have thumbs so theoretically they can't really help me at all but there they are right in the middle of all of my work. So here is me putting those little wood pieces in that kind of keep it in place. Um, I kind of hate them a lot because if you accidentally stick them in the wrong slot, they end up getting stuck. So my first go through of recording this, I was talking about just how my life is chaotic and how making this shelf kind of helped uh, to clear some of that up, I guess. Because if you're anything like me, you felt this whole year as chaotic and just doing this kind of made me have some small amount of control over my life, I guess. So it was nice to kind of just, I guess, distract myself with something productive, you know what I mean? Instead of just sitting around and feeling sorry for myself. I also am super proud of myself for building these because I am the kind of queen that builds like everything. My boyfriend doesn't build those shelf things that we bring home, like I don't force him to do it. I'm like, bitch, let me do it. I'm excited. Um, and it gives me an excuse to use the little, the small amounts of power tools that we do have. So yeah. Also, other random fact, I was watching Sailor Moon R while watching this and eating little watermelon candies. Um, they were delightful. Alright, so here I am putting together the top portion of the shelf with the bottom portion of the shelf, which is one of the most irritating and annoying parts of it because there's a certain part on there that you have to turn and make sure it clicks into place, I guess. So here you can see me low-key struggling with this big-ass top portion trying to put it on top so that way I can just like put them together. And then here's this odd screwing in process where we're trying to get it just perfect even though it doesn't want to work with me whatsoever. <laughs> After all of that, finally the shelf is done. I just need to add the other little shelf pieces on it, which is awesome. Uh, like I said, I'm not going to show the production of the other shelf because hell no, it's just the same process of me struggling. Here they are, fully built, and here's me doing a little happy dance that I built them. Hope you enjoy that. So I started off my organization with uh, basically shirts or night clothes or anything undergarment related towards the top. And then my regular t-shirts and pants and stuff towards the bottom of the shelf. I also kept anything with like my overalls or one pieces or things kind of like that towards the bottom next to the pants. And also my shorts and things like that. 
Sorry about the mess in the background and also my dog. Um, th for the next bit, I have these little clear bins here to which I put kind of my underwear, socks. <laughs> Sorry, Arthur ran behind my bed. I had to go get him out. <laughs> um, but yeah, underwear, socks, uh, pantyhose, things like that. Anything kind of related to that area, I just put in these. And I really love that they have like the little clear uh, front to them so I can kind of see what's clean and what's not. Super helpful. Um, so I didn't really have enough time to finish doing all the clothes. Uh, I was exhausted after building two shelves. But the next day I ended up folding everything that we had that was clean and just sitting in baskets all around the house. And I started folding them and putting them on the shelf the way I wanted. Uh, so here's kind of how the organization started. So like you see, um, we have kind of the shirts, um, like the regular shirts in the middle, anything that's like kind of night shirt I put towards the top and I started trying to color code them as well or at least put similar colors together just because I figured it would look nicer that way. I do this also with my books on my bookshelf and it looks amazing so I figured why not with the clothes right? My boyfriend has so many shirts too by the way that it started to consume all of the shelves. Um, so I feel like we need to go through those and maybe get rid of a couple of them and start working on getting him some pants because he doesn't have nearly as many pants as he does shirts <laughs> and I feel like that's a problem. Yeah, so here is kind of how it ended up looking. Um, I really love it so much. It looks so cute. Here's me ending off this video by doing some weird poses and also dancing a little bit for you. I hope you enjoy it. Um, I think it came out really awesome and let me know what you think. Uh, would you end up doing the same thing? Have you already done the same thing? Or do you just keep, you know, the dresser the way it is? <laughs> or all your clothes in your dresser? Um, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.